Hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. We made a video, it's called The Benefit of Drinking the Blessed Urine of the, Our Holy Prophet. And for sure his urine is blessed. You know, when somebody says to you the blessed urine, I'm not talking about even Muhammad now, I'm talking about his urine. The urine of the Prophet is blessed. So the Muslim they say the blessed Allah. The Muslim they say the blessed Muhammad. And then the Muslim, they say the blessed urine of the Prophet Muhammad. I remember the hadith where the Muslims, they were fighting over the poo, poo or the blessed donk of the camel of Aisha. Actually, there's a video about it in a movie made by Muslims about Muslims sniffing and touching the donk and putting it around their face because simply it is the camel of Aisha donk. Very beautiful. If you go and see the comment, you will see the Muslim saying the following. Tim Hamad said, Jesus in the Bible says, I came with sword, not with peace. And here we, we laugh. I mean, what this guy is talking about, let us say for the sake of argument that what he's quoting is what he meant, which is not. But why he is a change in the topic and he is not answering us about everything we said in the video. That Muhammad taking shower with dead dogs, women of blood from period, with garbage, saying that the water is always pure about the muslims washing and blessed and drinking the urine of the prophet about the muslim fighting over his urine about drinking camel urine about the naked musas about what did that say they changed the topic and then he says for licked nude with young boys can you show me a verse or for licked nude with the young boys Everybody dying laughing at the lies they fabricate and they post in the front of our face. However, as I know, that is in the Quran, my friend, where your God, he said, I promise you young little boys who they are beautiful and they will never bleed. Bleed from what? From sex? You tell me. They will go around them and they will serve them with wine, cup of wine. And next to you will, women, will be women with big boobs and your private part will be endless penis. Look how they fabricate. How in the world do Christian worship war Lord with a file as God? You see, they say that we Muslims we respect Jesus. He just called Jesus war Lord with a file. First of all, show us how Jesus is war Lord. Secondly, where do you get this with a word with a file from? As I know, it's your prophet who said that he did marry according to Aisha that he married her at the age of six and he was molesting her at the until the age of nine and then he did intercourse which means he raped her so they are the one who follow a pedophile and yet they are number one who speak against pedophile as they claim but in fact every muslim is allowed to marry children and to practice pedophile practice for their best man is a pedophile so what you expect from followers of pedophile no wonder churches is being shattered worldwide my friend as i know Christianity is the more discriminated belief until now, starting from Islamic countries. So if we are shattered as you claim, how come you are afraid to open, we open a church in Saudi Arabia? How come you are afraid to open churches in Pakistan? How come you are afraid in all Islamic countries? If we are shattered, we are destroyed. The answer is very simple. Islam is weak and you know that the Christians will take over in the day you let Christianity go there. Coward like your prophet. Take another comment. I took a snapshot of them because YouTube don't allow me to zoom in. <clears throat> this Muslim, he posed for us. Uh, and the funny, he said he called himself coronavirus. You should call yourself Quran virus, my friend. And the example of a bad word is like a bad tree uprooted from the surface of the earth not having any stability it's not like muhammad as usual he's stealing what jesus said that uh, the seed which is fading into a rock they cannot grow good hmm? they don't have a stability as usual muhammad is a thief secondly you are saying that bad word the example of a bad word okay let's examine what bad word is is me teaching you to beat your wife a bad word or good word? Have you ever heard of a good God teaching a good man to, to, to beat his wife? 
that is a good word what about the good word where you are allowing and you're ordering your followers to have sex with the children at the age of six years old like Aisha is that a good word or a bad word what about your prophet saying if you see Christian or Jew in the street spit in their face and force them to walk in the sewage humiliate them is that a good word or a bad word what about saying take not Christian and Jews as a friends is that a good teaching or a bad teaching what about God saying I will spread hatred and enmity between the Christians until judgment day which means that your God Allah is the devil himself for the one who spread hatred and enmity is nothing but the devil and you are talking about good words next comment did that destroy all ex Tian, which means Christian we are not ex my friend it's your prophet who is ex he is dead he is routing and the Messiah will never be ex he is alive even in the cult of Muhammad he destroyed all Christians in the the fact is not true my friend uh, first of all there was no debate because the dad he chose people who know nothing about Islam the dad debate should be between two people debating both religion not only one in the stage accusing the other one of things and the other one he know nothing about the other one which mean if I want to debate the dad and actually as long as you are talking about the dad how come you don't mention what happened in this video I just destroyed him in less than 15 minute video the dad is shattered like a glass he is the one who said that God will never order shameful order to his prophet and what was that example being naked and we showed you how your prophet said that Allah he made Moses go naked so how come you don't answer the that who made a shame of Allah just to show you how stupid what you are saying because in the video here we played for you how your prophet speaking about Allah making Moses walking naked and the dad saying God will never let such a shameful thing for a prophet to walk naked in the street which means the dad agree that this is a shameful thing if Allah do it which means Muhammad is shameful Allah is shameful Islam is a shameful cult and this is what the dad said and instead of answering what the dad said what you do you say he destroyed us we are laughing the dad is the one who said that in the bible it says command like it says that i will make a dunk in your face and he said this is funny stupid command shameful command but look the title of the video is this is your muslim website the benefit of drinking the blessed urine of the holy prophet so the dad is making fun of islam making fun of allah making fun of muhammad and not only that Muhammad he is the one who ordered to drink camel urine in the Bible it says this is a prophecy that if you disobey me you will be humiliated here you Muslim you worship up urine here your prophet is ordering you to drink urine and yet you are talking about he destroyed us ah, people will be the judge then he says <clears throat> how many version Bible till now you have this is all translation Abdul how many translation you have for the Quran However, how many Arabic Quran you have? You have many. According to the scholars, there is more than 900 reading of the Quran. Where we can find them? Your Prophet himself in the Hadith, he admit that Allah, he gave him seven Quran. Where are they? And not only that, he said, my people will not be able, they are not capable of doing it, which means Muslim cannot live with one Quran. They need seven. Where are they? In the top of that, you said, why Catholic Bible why different from a Christian Bible that's stupid of you because Catholic are a Christian you idiot secondly it's not different there's books of tradition considered for the Protestant a book of traditions and there's books is considered for the Catholic it should be part of the Bible however those books are existence is not even important the reason for that for Catholic and Protestant both they follow the gospel and the gospel is what we base our faith on the Catholic they have the same four Gospels as the Protestant as the Catholic as, as, the, as the Orthodox and the books which consider as a tradition it can be added or it cannot it's like you Muslim you put Sahih Bukhari right huh? she has say we don't accept Sahih Bukhari <laughs> however for us we are not the same as Shia and Sunni that will not change our faith because simply all of us we agree with the four Gospels and all of them they agree word by word about Jesus being God crucified God the Father God the Son God the Holy Spirit 
In the same time, if I ask you, do you have even a single Quran is approved? The most popular Quran you have is called Quran of Uthman. But where is the Quran of Uthman? Where we can find it? It doesn't exist. And you know, for me, I don't care about how many Quran really. What I care that all what you have is lovable. A God who says, hail coming from heh, mountains in heaven. Women have a sperm coming from the location of the necklace in her ribs. Man have a sperm coming from the backbone. God who ordered to beat your wife, have sex with the children. So if you are proud about a book, what about you quote for us something good from your book so we can laugh? However, I challenge you, I challenge you to find me anything will make us a Christian, not a Christians. As an example, by saying different Bible. Are you saying different teaching or different translation? All of them, they agree. All of them, they confess. All of them, they announce that Jesus is God. God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit, and the crucifixion of Jesus, proving that Muhammad is a liar when he said this is not true. Let us continue with more comment. I don't know if we have more. Oh, this is a video I took in my trip. I will post it later. So, leave your comment, please, and let us laugh at the, at the comment which made by the Muhammad and trying their best to answer us, trying their best to refute us, but sadly, they avoid every topic in the videos trying to speak about something else because Islam cannot handle the truth. That Muhammad is a bit of fire, criminal, thousands of people killed, Jesus never commits sin, never killed a person, never harm a person, and never own a slave. Your prophet is a slave buyer and seller, slave maker. That is your prophet. Thank you very much. God bless you and see you with more videos.